Yeah, I swear I met the devil tonight. <laughs> I ate my first chimichanga with my french fries and my, my uh, uh, Parmesan cheese. I went to bed about 5.30 tonight. Woke up around 9.45, 9.35, something like that. Oh, man. Something was eating up inside me like it was the devil trying to get out. So I let him out. I snatched up them grapes, and I ate me some of them grapes. I'm still feeling it. It's the aftermath. Whew. I thought... I thought I was beaten with the devil for sure. I thought he was just going to eat me up sitting there on that toilet. And just come out. Gone. <laughs> and, and I can still feel it. I can still feel it. I can still feel it. I don't know what is wrong with me, but I do dumb, dumb stuff. <laughs> I put eight ghost peppers in there, plus those other chili lime peppers, plus those cilantro peppers, plus those jalapeno peppers. Plus Brandon Boy's other, he said they were jalapeno peppers. Plus, a quarter bottle of the my devil's dust, <laughs> and then to top it off, just to top it off, <laughs> I made some more of that Mexican cheese. Now I I don't know if I show job, but I I take the Parmesan cheese or no not the Parmesan cheese, I take the mozzarella cheese and the sharp cheddar cheese, mix it together in a big bowl and pour devil's dust on there. I didn't put too much, but just enough. Because you know, that's how they do it in the Mexican store. Not the Mexican store, but the Mexican cheese. Kraft Mexican cheese. They don't do it like that no more. You ever see the cheese they got now? Ugh. Crappy. Nasty. It used to be the Sinatra taco cheese. Mexican cheese. It's not even looking healthy anymore. It's just real thin stuff and, and just a little bit of spice, a little bit, whatever. It just don't look right. You know, I just get me a big monster bag of mozzarella, a big monster bag of cheddar, you know. Get the cheap stuff, whatever. Mix it up, put some devil's dust in there. See, that's what I mean. I'm <laughs> I don't know what is wrong with me. But after all them peppers, the, the, the ghost peppers, the ghost peppers, did you see the video? Oh my God. I mean, when I was cooking them in the meat, did you see that? I had to open up the door. I was holding my my sweatshirt over my face. And, and thank God I had that air f exhaust fan above the stove, had that on, on high. And you could just see it just sucking all that stuff right up in the plant and right outside and I had the door open I had the air conditioner on oh my god well they say the Ed Crean or whatever his name is the guy that grows these peppers Ed Curry the guy that grows these peppers hold on the Druid? Druid? Druid on my chest? Druid on my chest? I'm like, what the heck? <sighs> well, I can sniff. This must be the stage three. Just from sitting down here, I can, I can feel it. Oh, I can feel it. Maybe it's the grapes. <laughs> I got these big old plum grapes. Oh my God, they're so big and delicious. They're seedless from Festival Foods. And uh, 
I eat, I eat some of those. And I keep them in the refrigerator nice and cold, you know what I mean? And maybe that's what's uh, evolving inside of me. And it's not feeling very good. I think I got to go number two again, but... Uh, oh, this is must be stage number three. I don't feel so good. Uh... The devil's coming out again. I gotta go. Bye.